talking is one thing and praying is another. You can share words, but you have to pray a prayer. See, a prayer is what God hears. A prayer is what God moves on. A prayer is what God answers. If you want your child to act right, I dare you to have a prayer life. Huh? That don't mean they won't they won't get out of hand every now and then. But you need a prayer life when they get out of hand. That's what my mama had. She had eleven children. With a switch and a flat. She had five. Oh, wow. And you mean to tell me some of us can't keep the church open? You know, when I look at these children, I look at mine, and look how small our children have been small. But all these children in the world, y'all. I'm going to preach down on what All these children in the world, all these children we got in the neighborhood, and we can't get but a handful in the church. There's something wrong somewhere. Ain't nothing wrong with the children. The adults don't want to have nothing to do with them. And when they get them now, they too busy doing the children, just running around wild and everything. We can't do that no more. It's time for us to stop that. I was looking at the scripture and I'm going to go on start now. I thank God that I can come back each year and see these children along waking up each year to see my children in the church. I don't think I'm disgraceful or not. I love the bunch of kids I got. And you all love the bunch of children you got. Because them you got doing, them you got in the church is doing something. And they like what they doing. And I like what mine is doing. I got it right on. Because if I don't, anybody else is. And you like what y'all be doing. What that song you said, Brother Monroe, they sang it. They just got through singing. it. He's alive. That gave me joy to get up church singing like that. What I'm saying, we come to have a great time today. Amen? Now, now, I'm not making excuses, but if I don't sound like I used to sound, then always remember something got to be wrong somewhere. And I don't mean sinfully wrong. Amen. But I'm a little weak now. You see, you ever had pilots and, 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 and that stuff get, get at your brain? And, uh, you ever heard those things? And just like a, a, a leech suck the blood out of you and, Cause you to your mind to go and come. Have you ever had that? Well, I tell you what, if you haven't, try not to have it. And if you got it, go get it taken care of. Because it'll keep you. But I'm still going to do what the Lord give me power to do. But I may not be as strong, but I'm going to be trying my best. The bus to God. Amen. Amen. And, and I feel like when you do your best for the Lord, you'll always overcome. Amen. So I say to the Monroe and this beautiful, I'm so proud of this, this church. I'm really so proud of this church. You ought to be. Huh? 
lot of folk, a lot of preachers are jealous of it. But this give me joy to see it. Because just like the Lord bless him again, I want him to do the same thing for me. Huh? Nah, it's me we say the same God. His time is right now. My time is out the while. I'll be here. He's about, I don't know how long, about five years old I am. We ain't too far behind. But when I get his age, I'm going to have mine too. Amen. So as I told you, he said, you know, Reverend, we still on top of the ground. That's a good thing, isn't it? Ain't y'all glad y'all still on top of the ground? Amen. 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 Ain't none of y'all in here ready to die. Is you? If you're about ready to die, you're going out there by yourself. Leave me alone. I won't live until I can't live no more. I thank God for this opportunity to be back here this yeah, I want to thank God for all my people and my, and my uh, uh, youth choir. Will y'all stand, please? What you see is what I got, and what I got is what I'm introducing you. Amen. Amen. Where's Ray Charles at? Stand up, Ray Charles. There he is right there. Yeah, that's Ray Charles right there. Come on up there. Now, we want them to, to come to the stand now. Amen. Hey, y'all, come on, babies. And if y'all give me a few minutes, I give you a good two hours. Amen. Y'all come on. Don't get lost in this big old beautiful church now. Amen. I thank God for my associate preacher, Reverend Jones, being with me. Quite some time, then 21 years. That made me 21 years older. But thank God for the 21 years. Thank God for our ushers who are standing on the door. Sister uh, Jose and Sister McIntosh, we thank them for being here. Thank Brother Mike for being with us again this evening, but most of all, we thank you for the darling of the church and of my home, Sister Sanders. Amen. And give a shout to Sister Sanders. She back there on the back row. Stand up, baby. Where you at? Do you hear me? Amen. Amen. Her hair done turned silver now. It used to be black. But it's silver, not gray, silver. Okay? <laughs> so I won't have to get it in the neck when I get home. Amen. Now we are uh, uh, ready to uh, uh, hear our choir do a couple of numbers or whatever they have, and then we're going to go ahead on and see what the Lord can do with me in his word.
up on the water. Who's that man all dressed in white? Now's on trouble on the water. Mm -hmm. Looks like the man of the Israelites. Now's 